From the smallest startups to the biggest global brands, accessible technologies are on display at CES 2017 to help us all live healthier, more independent lives. VFO is an organization who's developed technology that assists people with visual impairments to access technology, to access print material, to either have it read to them or to make it larger, either in print or in braille. So we're really focused around improving the lives of people with visual impairments. There are over one billion people worldwide with some type of disability, and in the U.S., over 10,000 people turn 65 every day. CTA research shows that the active aging market alone will grow from 24.4 billion to 42.7 billion by 2020. And so technology is going to be a huge, huge enabler for folks that are looking at uh, monitoring their vitals, making sure that um, they're able to uh, um, deal with like fall preventions. So we see um, technology as being a huge, huge advocate for individuals that are needing care in the caregiving space. And what we've developed is a belt uh, that can determine a human fall in progress and we're deploying about a two inch air cushion uh, immediately prior to impact to protect them in the event of a fall. In its second year, the accessibility marketplace has grown by 50% at CES 2017. Partnering with the Extreme Tech Challenge, the CTA Foundation received over 300 entries to select the five winners of our Eureka Park Accessibility Contest in 2017. We developed actually a new kind of trading technology which uh, can be applied in different applications, but Light Up is our first creation and we are really proud that we can change million lives actually with only one product. We make a device here at Banson Labs called Zogo and it connects people with disabilities to consumer technology. So all the expensive proprietary hardware that's on a wheelchair, we allow it to work with cable boxes, video game systems, smart homes and devices like that. Kintrans is automating sign language interpretation. So we create natural two-way conversations between people who use their body movement and sign language and people who use their voice in speaking. Aura is a new service for the blind and the visually impaired people. What we do is, uh, for a monthly fee, we send our users a pair of smart glasses and uh, ask them to download an Aura app. So they can either use the glasses or the phone to connect to a remote human agent. So the idea is, any activity that our user wants to do, they can just tap in and get an agent within less than 10 seconds. CTA Foundation is bringing together leaders in technology and in accessibility and aging to help address these challenges. To learn more, visit ctafoundation.tech. For CES TV, I'm Steve Yule.